Welcome to GDs. And this is, Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl. Movie starts, in 1970s, when the ship, HMS Dauntless, was on its way to the Port Royal, and it encounter a shipwreck, and recovers a boy. The boy's name is Will Turner, and the governor's daughter, Elizabeth, who is present on the ship, discovers a golden pirate medallion around his neck, and she takes it, in order to cover the fact that the boy might be a pirate, which in turn could have landed him in prison. Eight years pass by, and Elizabeth has kept the secret of the medallion. While Will, became an apprentice of a blacksmith. At the same time, a notorious pirate, Captain Jack Sparrow, makes his way to the port city on a sinking boat. And he let the guards, guarding the ship know, that he is there to steal a ship. Meanwhile, Captain James Norrington, has been promoted to Commodore, and he proposes to Elizabeth. But Elizabeth, is not interested in him, and with her corset being tight, she faints, and falls into the sea. And the medallion on her neck, sends a pulse across the ocean. Captain Jack, seeing Elizabeth fall, jumps in the sea, and rescues her. But when Norrington reaches there, instead of thanking him, he identifies him to be a pirate, and orders for his arrest, but he was able to escape, as he took Elizabeth hostage, and as he escapes, he lets them know, that they will always remember this day, as the day, they almost captured Captain Jack Sparrow. And as he escapes, he runs into Will, and they duel, and Will, impresses Jack. But before he could escape, he is knocked out, and arrested. And that night, the Black Pearl, a dreaded pirate ship, attacks the port city, searching for the medallion. And the crew of the Pearl, captures Elizabeth, and they, take her to meet the captain of the Black Pearl, Captain Barbosa. Will, sees Elizabeth being taken, but before he could go after her, he was knocked out. On the Black Pearl, Elizabeth, claims her last name as Turner, to conceal her identity, as the governor's daughter. And Captain Barbosa, explains to her, that the medallion is one of 882 gold pieces, that his crew took from a treasure of Hernán Cortés, on Isla de Muerta. And the gold was as a payment, to stop the massacre against the Aztecs, but Cortés, being too greedy rejected it. And the Aztec gods put a curse on the treasure. And this, cursed gold, cursed Barbosa and his crew, turning them into immortals, who appear skeletal in the moonlight. And they are not able to feel or taste anything. Thus, he along with his crew, have returned all, but one of the pieces of gold, and with Elizabeth's medallion being the final piece, they can finally lift the curse. Captain Barbosa takes her prisoner, believing she is the daughter of William Bootstrap Bill Turner. And we learn, that he was one of their crew members, whom they threw off the Pearl, as he didn't like the mutiny, because of which Captain Jack Sparrow, lost the command of the Black Pearl. Back in the city, as Will wakes up, he goes to the Commodore, but he dismisses him. And Will, knowing the only other person who can help him is Captain Jack, rescues him from prison. But Jack, only agreed to help him, after knowing who his father was. And they strike a deal, where Jack will help him rescue Elizabeth, and he will assist him in taking back, the Black Pearl. Will and Jack, commandeer HMS Interceptor, and head towards Tortuga, to gather a crew. And there, Jack enlists Gibbs, one of his old associates, to help them assemble a crew. And finally having a crew, they sail towards the Pearl, to the Isla de Muerta. With Jack, using his broken compass for navigation. And as they reach, the Black Pearl, was already there. And Will, and Jack, go to rescue Elizabeth. And as they reach the caves, they witness Captain Barbosa, sacrificing Elizabeth's blood, and returning the final gold piece. But the curse is not lifted, as Elizabeth does not carry the blood of Bootstrap Bill, who was Will's father, and a previous crew member of the Pearl. Will, not sure of Jack's true intentions, knocks him out, and rescues Elizabeth. While the rest of them were busy arguing. And he brings her back to the Interceptor, and following the pirate's code, they leave Jack behind. Jack, is captured by Barbosa, and he locks him up, in the Pearl. As they pursue the Interceptor. On the Interceptor, Elizabeth, lets Will know about the medallion. And also informs him, that she took it to keep him safe, when they first met. Black Pearl, was able to catch up with the Interceptor. Although Will, and Elizabeth, tried to fight. But they were finally defeated, and their crew was captured, and the Interceptor was destroyed. Will, makes a deal with Barbosa, to release Elizabeth, and for the safety of his crew, in exchange for his blood. Barbosa agrees, but exploits a loophole in the agreement, and he maroons Elizabeth, and Jack. And it was the same island, on which he previously left Jack, 
after mutiny. With only one pistol, and one round. On the island, Elizabeth makes a smoke signal, and Norrington looking for her, sees the signal and brings the Dauntless to rescue her, and arrest Jack. Elizabeth, convinces Norrington, to pursue the Pearl and to save Will, by accepting his marriage proposal. And at night, the Dauntless arrives at Isla de Muerta. Jack tells Norrington, that he will lure the pirates out to be ambushed by the crew of the Dauntless. And they allow him to go into the caves. But Jack, persuades Barbosa's crew, to attack the Dauntless, before they lift the curse, and lose their immortality. And as he explains to them, he steals a medallion, from the cursed chest. Barbosa sends his crew to attack. And they go under the water, leveraging their immortality, as Norrington and his men, wait on the shore, in boats. Meanwhile, Elizabeth, escapes from the Dauntless, and goes to the Black Pearl, and frees Jack's crew. But they refuse to rescue Jack and Will, citing Pirate's Code. Elizabeth tries to convince them letting them know that the codes are just guidelines. But they are not convinced, and Elizabeth sets out to rescue them on her own. And Jack's crew departs, with the Black Pearl. In the caves, Jack, passes a sword to Will, and he fights with the crew. While Jack goes for a duel with Barbosa. Elizabeth, also reaches the caves, and joins the fight, helping out Will. And when, Barbosa stabs Jack, he learns, that Jack took a piece of gold from the chest, and is cursed and unable to die. On the other hand, Norrington learning his ship is being attacked by pirates, returns back to fight with them. And in the caves, Jack shoots Barbosa, and Will returns both coins to the chest with his and Jack's blood on them. And thus, the curse is finally lifted and Barbosa dies from Jack's gunshot, with the one bullet, he left with him after marooning. The rest of Barbosa's crew is also no longer immortal, and they surrender. And as Jack will and Elizabeth return, Jack finds, that the Black Pearl has left him behind, and he is arrested. And back in town, he is about to be hanged. But Will, after confessing his love for Elizabeth, goes to break Jack free, at the last moment. But he is unsuccessful, and they are surrounded. Will, makes a stand for Jack, and seeing them, Elizabeth also makes a stand for them, and confesses her love for Will. Governor Swan pardons Will, and gives his blessing for Elizabeth to marry him. And Commodore Norrington doesn't object. But before they could capture Jack, he dives into the sea and escapes on the Black Pearl, which came back for him, citing the pirate codes to be just guidelines. And he reclaims the ship and his new crew. While Norrington, permits Jack and the Pearl, one day's head start, before initiating a pursuit. And as the movie ends, Will and Elizabeth finally kiss, while Captain Jack Sparrow, moves toward a new shore. Thanks for watching. And if you liked it, please subscribe.